Hi, my name is Mike. I'm from American Sign Products, and I'd like to take you through some of the ABCs of sign making. We fre frequently get asked uh, questions about how signs are made. Uh, it's a very simple business. Uh, in a sense, it's a very nice home-based business that people can get into, especially in this tough economy. And we'd like to take you through some of the uh, uh, simple methods of creating your own signs for not only for you, for your friends, uh, also business acquaintances and whatnot. Again, regarding the home-based business, really there's not too many components that you need to con concern yourself with. You obviously need a computer and the more USB ports you have, that's very helpful. The most memory that you can afford is also good. Uh, secondly, you need some type of computer program, either one that comes with your plotter, or you can go out and get uh, some of the name brand sign making software. So those are a couple of the big pieces that you need. To continue on, we also uh, recommend, obviously, that you have some other key components in the sign making end. You need vinyls, you need a pre-mask, and of course you need some type of plotter. The plotter we happen to be running is a 64 inch plotter, but there's a variety of different ones made as well, all the way down to 24 inches as well. Once the information is sent from the computer to the uh, plotter, the plotter will begin to cut, and obviously depending on how intricate the graphic is or what type of material you're cutting, uh, will indicate how fast or how slow the plotter will actually uh, react. You can cut all kinds of uh, vinyls on this particular plotter, everything from reflective to window tint films to uh, just standard straight up vinyls. This particular plotter features a cross cut feature. as simple and as quick as that. One of the uh, questions that frequently comes up is what's the difference between a kiss cut and a die cut or a perf cut? And uh, what I'd like to show you today is the fact, number one, why would you use a perf cut versus a kiss cut? Obviously on the kiss cut, you're talking about some vinyl that basically just will peel and remove right from the liner. On the perf cut, you're looking at actually creating a decal where you're actually cutting through part of the liner and then able to peel it apart very simply and create a vinyl label. You can use it for everything from football helmets to whatever else applications that you want individually uh, die cutting uh, right directly from the plotter. You can see as the uh, plotter does the perf cut or uh, die cut uh, that it's staggering the head up and down. And this particular plotter happens to be a 64 inch plotter, but they're also available down to 24 inches as well. Here it's also doing the cross cut. So in addition to having the uh, perf cut uh, label, if you will, it also s separates it into individual sheets, which makes it very easy to handle for you and also potentially for your customers.